I understand this is your first uh, American movie, your American film debut, mm -hmm. and what a crazy way to start. I know. <laughs> is it, or isn't this like a frightening movie to start with? Yeah, everybody keeps asking me that, but it probably <laughs> is. <laughs> I didn't, like, it must be true. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I mean, I was just so, like, I couldn't wait to start filming when I was preparing. I, I had this physical transformation. I was working out six hours a day, six days a week with this... Um, champion triathlete that got me through like this whole they wanted me to gain 15 uh, p uh, pounds of muscle so to make me very strong and I went into this whole um, journey where I actually had like a physical transformation so I couldn't wait to start filming actually and be working on my craft oh, yeah. uh, next to you know working on my body and the physicality of the part um, so I I think you know I felt the stress and I felt the weight on my shoulders but also, Denis made it such a such a safe environment for his crew and his cast to flourish in, I guess, to grow in and to be vulnerable and to try things. And um, there was it was just it was it was teamwork really. It was team effort, and um, that was just a wonderful thing to experience. But now, after all the junkets, you're just scared as <laughs> hell. <laughs> yeah, now you make me scared. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna pee my pants. You remember you. the first time you walked on set, and uh, well, both when you walked on set and saw the environment, but also when you met, you know, the Blade Runner legend, Harrison mm -hmm. Ford. How was that like? Then I peed my pants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, um, no, I, I was thinking we were in this very small space together, so there's not not really any space for a camera operator, and Dini was there to give us like notes and uh, uh, talk us through the scene, and but he left us when we were filming, so it was just me and Harrison. And I remember thinking, okay, just don't look at him. Think, you know, Han Solo, Indiana Jones. Don't think about that. Just focus on the scene. I'm fucking nervous. Don't show it, <laughs> you know. And from the moment I looked at him, he was cracking one joke after the other. You probably noticed it when you were interviewing yep. him that he's good at jokes yeah. and storytelling. So he just started, and never stopped, and he made me literally pee my pants laughing instead of being nervous. Um, yeah, and he was just so much fun. He doesn't really take anything too seriously, but when the camera is on, he'll give 200%. But it, it's, a, it's a legend. It must be surreal, though, to have the king of one-liners just coming at you in your <laughs> face know. with them. How would be, is this really happening? I know. Yeah, I remember being there with Denis and just laughing and laughing and laughing. You know, he'll, he would say, uh, let's shoot this piece of shit before every time <laughs> when we did it taken. Um, yeah, I don't know. He was just, he would ask Denis, like, what do you want? Like, I have I have three or four faces. Do you want face number one? And he'll pull the face and face number two, because I only have four. So be very careful what face you uh, you want for this scene, you know. And, and very, I don't know. I can't do it. He's just so funny. <laughs> um, yeah, so all good memories of right. that. From, uh, from the footage we saw, we saw 20 minutes. It seems like you're teaming mostly up with with Jared, mm -hmm. and we read that he, he blinded himself or something. Like, not for real though, but he tried to. His uh, method, yeah. yeah. How how's that working around with? It was actually, it. I kind of think it did something to the scenes that I hadn't expected before. Because um, I'd never worked with a method actor like that. Um, so for me, it was a new experience. It was very intriguing. Uh, coming to set and never having met Jared in real life and introducing myself as love and he introduced himself as Neander Wallace and there we went, you know, and um, it created this a certain amount of distance and awkwardness in a sense that helped the scene in a way which is very interesting. It made my character as love long for more approval and it made him get be further and further away from me as a character so uh, because I didn't know him and it, we didn't talk before right so um, there was a distance that actually elevated the scenes to a certain extent.